Hey everybody, it's Chris Young for Gander RV and Outdoors, standing inside the spacious 2020 Heartland Mallard M26. Now, this is a bunkhouse travel trailer, very well built, very economical. As a matter of fact, I want you to take a look at the ceiling. 80 inches in height and they have arched ceilings, which really helps with the elements, keeps rain and snow off of it. Everything just kind of slides off. But I wanted to start on the inside back here in the bunk area. I'm gonna move out the way so you can see. Extremely plush, thick, three inches of foam on these teddy bear furry mattresses. And each one of these bunks can hold 300 pounds. Easily an adult, definitely some kids. And if you're looking for some space for your hiking shoes, running shoes, maybe your backpacks, whatever, you got you know fishing rods, throw your stuff down there. We're gonna go to the bathroom before I show you some of the other stuff. Look at the leg room in this thing. I mean, for being over six feet tall, this is good space. Got the foot flush on the toilet here. Got your nice big window, plenty of vanity space, single basin sink. Here is your mirrored medicine cabinet right there in the corner. But we come over to the shower. Look how light this looks with just the skylight in here. I mean, it's bright, the sun's coming through, and I got plenty of headroom to move around and do my business. Plus with the single surround with the corner notches in there, just gives this shower a really nice residential feel. So we come out, go right past the bunks. And one of my favorite features on these Heartland Mallards, the road vac system, central vacuum. So all you gotta do instead of bringing your own vac to clean stuff up, just plug the hose in there and go. There's a collection port underneath in the storage where you can get everything out of. Got pantry storage right here, right beside your large black-faced Dometic refrigerator. And I'm a big fan of the black facing on these. I just think that's nice. You, you see a lot of the stainless steel or the white. I'm a big fan of that. Plus this runs on both electric and gas. Come over to the dining area. Got the convertible dinette, which can easily sleep two people. But take a look at the light, airy feel of not only the tabletop, but these windows. Look how giant that is. That, my friend, is some light and some air. You want to get the breeze blowing and enjoy the meals, maybe playing cards, doing the board games, whatever you want to do with the family and friends, you can do right there. And if you need additional storage, underneath both sides, got plenty of room there. If you want to store some of your hunting equipment and your camping equipment, you're good to go. And the detail that Heartland has put into their manufacturing really adds a nice residential feature with the grooves, with these candlelight looking fixtures, just really pleasant. Come over to the kitchen and you'll see you got countertop space. What do I say? Four days. Prep, prep, prep. Got a 60-40 sink with the cutting boards on top. And yes, we have had people ask us, okay, what is that fluid that looks like blood? That's not blood, even though I am clumsy and I do hit myself a lot. That's winterization fluid. So every year it's important to winterize and de-winterize your camper. Shaker style cabinets with the brushed nickel fixtures. Take a look in there for your space. Got your microwave here, all the appliances matching in color, which I think is a great feature. Backsplash, glass cover on the three burner stove. I did remove the grill grate there, but it does come with one. Got the LED accents and you got your oven right there. So good camper to entertain, to spend a long weekend. I mean, you got space and storage enough that you don't have to worry about coming back same day. I mean, this is a long time camper. Leather convertible right here that folds out into a bed, not just a jackknife, folds out into a bed. Just one of those nice features that Heartland does with their manufacturing and lots of storage. LED backlit and strut assisted right behind those solid shaker cabinets with the uh, glass. I mean, it's just residential, residential. One of my favorite features too. This right here, the backing for the TV swivels around. So if you're done watching TV here, you can flip it around for the master bedroom. Got more of those glass Shaker style cabinets right here, storage underneath. There's your command center CD player. And then we come around to the master bedroom and you'll see large ward to put your hanging clothes in. 
You got more storage up top, including some LED lights on the front end cap here. But I want you to take a look at those little nightstands right there. Yes, you got tabletop space, so if you want to put your CPAP machine, book, phone, but you have little coveys in there where you can stick stuff in as well. Just a great little unit, economical, well-built, sturdy, two-inch thick walls, four-inch thick ceiling, great for the elements no matter where you're at. So we've seen the inside of this M26. What do you say we go take a look on the outside? Dance party, anybody? Okay, guys, here we are on the outside, the 2020 Heartland Mallard M26. We start up front with your two propane tanks, 20 pound each. Come over to the diamond plated rock guard right in below this beautifully built solid fiberglass end cap. That is really good construction right there. Plus with the two inch laminated foam core walls, two inch thick and then four inch on the roof, you're really gonna have a good time keeping the elements that you want out, out and the ones that you want in, in. These are magnetic plus anti-slam. So pass through storage, not only is well lit and covered, got the uh, floor down there, but take a look at these bad boys right here. These, my friends, are your power leveling jacks. So you don't have to worry about cranking those out. Just push them up and down when you're ready to go. You got your front and your rear right there. We also wanted you to see how big and spacious this awning is. For entertaining, this is a great area. Just look at the size and the width of this. Plus, there's LED lights underneath and these arms adjust so you can move the pitch up and down as needed. Solid step above steps. We come over to the wide track suspension on these two 15 inch aluminum wheels. And you'll notice it's a lot wider gap in between there because that helps the ride less bounce and makes it a lot more smooth. Got your charging ports outside here as well. And two exterior speakers that are extremely loud for entertaining because when you have something like this M26, good chance you're gonna have the exterior kitchen as well. So, Want to do some grilling outside, some cooking outside, do some prep and some cleaning as well. Got a sink, got a light, got the smooth countertop, got the fridge as well. And take a look at these rounded edges, all sealed and insulated underneath. Come back to the rear where you can find your exterior shower with both hot and cold. Four by four sewer storage hose there, sealed tinted safety glass all the way around. Got your spare tire. And if you notice, these are set up for backup camera. So if you wanna get that installed, just talk to our service folks. They'll be glad to help you out. Come back around here to your dumps. Got your gray tank number one, sewer connection outlet and a wastewater holding tanks. The dumps are under there. Got your 50 amp service right here. City water connections and tank flush right there, as well as your cable. Got the solid slides and a power pole. That does not come with the camper, by the way, just in case you were wondering. But we come back around here. That is the other leveling jack. Yes, so if you ever see that, chances are that means you got a power leveling jack. Always check the side plate as well. That's going to tell you how much this vehicle weighs, gross weight or kilograms. But always talk to the RV specialist as well too, because what your tow vehicle may be able to tow and what a camper weighs, you need to talk to the specialist because they can tell you the difference between gross vehicle weight, total weight, if you got storage people, how much the water is gonna weigh, the whole nine. Always check with them. But if you've been looking to upgrade that camping experience to something that's gonna be economical and durable, you wanna come take a look at the Heartland Mallard, the 2020s, the M26s, especially if you're looking for bunks. Lightweight, great, durable, economical camper. Tell me some comments down below. What would you like to do with this camper? Where do you see yourself taking it? What's your dream trip? I'd love to know. We love hearing the stories about what you like, what you don't like, and where you'd like to go. I'm Chris Young for Gander RV and Outdoors. Thank you so much for spending time with me today. If you have any questions, please let us know. Until then, have fun camping and hey, come get a Mallard. I'll see you soon.